What's going on, everybody? Appreciate you guys tuning in to the channel. My name's Cam Rhodes, and today we are going to be talking about Lightyear. So before we do my Lightyear review, I want to make sure you guys get more content like this. So like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, all right? Cool. All right, so Lightyear is the latest movie from Disney and Pixar. So it's not exactly a Toy Story movie, but it kind of is. It takes place uh, outside of the Toy Story universe in the sense that this is the movie that Andy saw when he was a kid that made him want a Buzz Lightyear action figure. Does that make sense? Y'all tracking with me? All right, cool. They say it at the beginning of the movie. And if you watch it as a movie in of itself, as its own sci-fi movie and not a Toy Story movie, I think you'll have a really good time. I think Pixar really wanted to flex and make a dope sci-fi movie and I think that's what they did. I can't remember the last time I watched an animated movie that gave me those sci-fi feels like this. Now whether parents and kids really enjoy that because it doesn't really feel like a, a Toy Story movie, I don't know. But for me, I really enjoyed it. Visuals were great. I mean, seeing some of those sequences where Buzz is going forward in time around the planet. And also I watched it on Disney Plus so you get the IMAX enhanced aspect ratio, that extra top and bottom with the IMAX enhanced, you know what I'm saying? You get the extra immersive feeling, you know? It just looks so crispy. crisp. So I love the arc of Buzz. I love how they took him from a guy that doesn't want any help from anybody else. He only wants to complete the mission to taking him to where this guy starts to learn how to operate as a team, starts to gain friendship, starts to see that it's not all about him. And I thought that they used the villain well in showing him as this is what the path that you're going down, Buzz, and this is what you can ultimately become. Now with the villain, I like the idea of the villain. There were some things as far as the execution that I didn't quite jive with. Like they didn't really set up whether this was an alternate version of Buzz or was this the same Buzz? And I'm really familiar with time travel, but I just didn't feel like they set that part up well. Anyway, that was the only doc I have for it, but maybe I was interpreting it wrong. Maybe I missed something in the dialogue. So if you know in the comments, make sure you let me know. This movie has a lot of heart, a lot of humor, great action. I thought the cast was great. You had Kiki Palmer, you had Taika Waititi. They were great supplements to Buzz and they added some comic relief. And I just had a really good time with this movie. All right, guys, so this is my Lightyear review. If you want more content like this, make sure you hit like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.